Do traumatic experiences affect women's sexuality? What is the truth about orgasm through clitoral stimulation? Hello to all lovers of psychology and sexuality. Today, we will unveil the sexual curiosities of women. If you are interested in these topics, make sure to subscribe and activate the notification bell to not miss our future videos. Also, leave us comments and share your experiences in the section below. Let's get started. Yes, traumatic experiences, such as sexual abuse or emotional trauma, can have a significant impact on women's sexuality. They can lead to issues like sexual dysfunction, post-traumatic stress disorder, and difficulties in sexual relationships. Clitoral stimulation is a common way for many women to achieve orgasm. It is a highly erogenous part of the female body and can be essential for experiencing sexual pleasure and orgasm. Changing norms. Social and cultural norms surrounding open relationships are evolving. What was once considered taboo or unacceptable is now more widely accepted in many communities. Chlamydia is one of the most common sexually transmitted diseases worldwide. It is estimated that more than 131 million new cases of chlamydia are reported globally each year. Classical music's effect. It has been observed that classical music, particularly Vivaldi's Autumn, can increase sexual arousal. Scientists believe this is due to the rhythm and structure of the music, which may match the rhythm of sexual activity. Clitoral size. The clitoris is an erectile organ containing over 8,000 nerve endings, but only a small part is externally visible. Most of the clitoris is located inside the body and extends to the base of the vulva. Clubs and communities. Online clubs and communities dedicated to the study and practice of the Kama Sutra have been formed, where people can share experiences, tips, and discuss its teachings. Common challenges. Pain during anal sex usually indicates that something is not going well. Open communication and adaptation are essential to overcome potential challenges. Common practice. Despite associated stigmas, anal sex is a common sexual practice and can be enjoyed by many couples as an additional form of intimacy. Communication and trust. Foreplay is an ideal time to strengthen communication and trust between partners. Openly discussing desires, boundaries, and preferences can enhance the sexual experience and emotional connection. In some rural communities in India, festivals and cultural events, including talks and educational activities on sexual and reproductive health, are held, leveraging social gatherings as learning opportunities. Community support. There are communities and support groups dedicated to open relationships where people can find guidance, resources, and camaraderie with others who share their lifestyle. Comprehensive sexual education. Comprehensive sexual education addresses a wide range of topics related to sexuality, including anatomy, reproduction, healthy relationships, consent, contraception, and prevention of sexually transmitted diseases, with the aim of promoting healthy and safe sexuality. Connection. Between sex and happiness, studies have shown that sexually active individuals tend to report higher levels of life satisfaction and overall happiness, although relationship quality and personal satisfaction also play a significant role. Conscious breathing. Practicing conscious breathing during foreplay can help women relax, increase sensitivity, and connect more deeply with their body and sexual sensations. Consent law. Consent is a fundamental principle in sexual relationships. Legally, the lack of consent in a sexual activity is considered sexual assault or rape, highlighting the importance of clear communication and mutual consent in any sexual interaction. Continued research. As the factors contributing to premature ejaculation are better understood, researchers continue to develop new treatment and management methods for this common sexual disorder. Control favoring positions. For some women, maintaining control during sexual activity is important, so they prefer positions where they can direct the pace and depth of penetration, such as cowgirl or modified missionary. 
Couple therapy. Couple therapy can be beneficial in addressing premature ejaculation as it can help improve communication, reduce anxiety, and develop joint strategies to overcome the problem. Couple therapy. In cases of anorgasmia affecting the couple's relationship, couple therapy may be beneficial for improving communication, addressing underlying issues, and finding joint solutions. Couples consumption. More and more couples are watching pornography together as a way to explore their sexuality, experiment with new ideas, and increase intimacy in their relationship. Creating a sensual environment. Carefully preparing the environment for foreplay with soft lighting, gentle music, and seductive scents can help create a sensual atmosphere that stimulates all the senses. Creativity and experimentation. Creativity and experimentation are key to keeping passion and excitement alive in sexual life. Being open to trying new sexual positions can lead to discovering new ways of pleasure and mutual satisfaction. Cultural differences in sex education. Cultural differences influence the sex education received by individuals, including messages about sexuality, sexual pleasure, and acceptable sexual practices. Cultural differences in sexual practices. Sexual practices vary widely among different cultures and societies, influenced by factors such as religion, history, and social norms. What may be considered taboo in one culture may be accepted in another, and vice versa. Cultural differences in the perception of sexuality. Attitudes towards sexuality vary significantly among different cultures and societies. What may be considered acceptable in one culture may be taboo in another, influencing people's sexual fantasies and practices. Cultural diversity. Pornography reflects a wide cultural diversity, with productions varying according to the preferences and taboos of different regions of the world, providing a window into the sexual expressions of diverse cultures. Cultural influence. Cultural attitudes towards sex and masculinity can influence the perception of premature ejaculation and men's willingness to seek professional help. Customized positions. Many couples develop their own unique and customized sexual positions, tailored to their bodies, preferences, and levels of intimacy, allowing them to explore their sexuality in a more satisfying and rewarding way. Decorative items. Decorative elements inspired by the Kama Sutra, such as figurines, paintings, and sculptures, are popular for those wishing to incorporate sensuality and erotic art into their home. Deep sensations. Some women prefer positions that provide them with a sense of depth during penetration, such as missionary with their partner's legs elevated or doggy style with downward tilt. Delayed orgasm. Some men may experience what is known as delayed orgasm, where they reach orgasm after a prolonged period of stimulation. It can be a satisfying experience for some, but frustrating for others. In some Scandinavian countries like Denmark, sex education has been introduced in nurseries for young children, aiming to teach them about the body, consent, and gender differences from an early age. Human sexuality is a fascinating and diverse field that never ceases to amaze us. Sexual curiosities unveil the wonderful complexity of the human experience in the intimate realm. As we explore and understand these facts, it is crucial to remember that each individual is unique in their sexual experience. Respecting and communicating with your partner are the keys to a satisfying and healthy sexual life. Sexual education and understanding are essential tools for fully embracing our sexuality,